Hello everyone and welcome back to the final part of the three-step video in creating a Facebook ad. So just to recap, what we've done so far is we've created a campaign objective. We have created one ad set called ad set one. We've defined the page, audience placement, budget and schedule. Now we can go ahead and create the ad. But just a tip before that, we have actually covered a lot of stuff in just these five steps and i would urge you to please go back and try creating an ad a couple of ad sets yourself try creating a few different kinds of campaigns yourself because that is the only way you're going to learn all i can do from my end is show you how to use these tools and give you a few tips here and there but then you have to have to create an ad yourself to actually learn the process anyways let's continue from here to create an ad have to give your ad a name um, and just leave it at add one uh, please do give more meaningful names to your ad or your ad set so that by just the name you know what the content is what the ad set is so while creating an ad you first have to select a format then the media and then the text so for page likes, we have three different kinds of formats here, a single image, a single video, or a slideshow. For now, let's select a single image. And what is the image you would want? So by default, it's selected my cover photo. I do not need that. There are a lot of free stock images that you can use uh, from Shutterstock. You could select, uh, you could search for say, marketing. And there you go, the few images that you could select for your ad and it's free. But then I already have an image designed and I'm going to use this for the ad. It's just a very plain image that says Facebook marketing for beginners. Uh, do keep in mind the recommended image specs. You would need the image of this size, the image ratio and always keep in mind to keep little or no text in the image. I have added a little text, but that's okay. Now let's move into text. So as you can see, the, ad, the screen is divided into two parts, the text and the ad preview. Uh, in the preview section, you can see how your ad is going to look like uh, in the desktop newsfeed or mobile or on a feature phone. This is how your ad is going to look like. Um, now let's edit the content here. Um, so let's say I leave it at that. Um, you can change the headline, but I'm going to leave it to the marketing guy. When someone clicks on the ad um, to view your page, do you want them to land on the timeline or the likes or the reviews or the photos? So I would let them land on timeline. Do you want to track conversions? So what you can basically do here is that you can, there's a code that Facebook gives you. You can go ahead and add it to your app or your website. And then when someone has clicked on any of your ad, whether it's this one, the page like ad or any other ad that you've created, and then they go and visit your website, you will be able to track how they got to your website and it's going to track back to this ad we'll get into much more detail about facebook pixels in the coming tutorials so well this is what the ad looks like interested in learning more about marketing on facebook like this page now and it has an image for marketing for beginners we can finally go ahead and place our order if you're creating an ad for the first time at this point you're probably going to get asked to fill in some your some of your card details so that facebook can charge you um, how you can add a daily budget uh, a daily spending limit to your account uh, those are the things i'm going to teach you later uh, but for now you have created your first ad congratulations this is called the Facebook ad manager where you can manage your ads. Let me just show you how to reach this page from Facebook. When you're on Facebook and like we selected 
create ads from here you can select manage ads and you will directly go into the facebook ad manager here you see a list of all the different manager accounts you own so i'm just going to go to my personal one there you go this is the ad manager here you can see your ad the campaign that we just created page likes for the marketing guy when you click on the campaign you will be able to see the ad sets that you've created under that campaign and when you click on the ad set you will be able to see the ad that you created under that ad set for every ad you can check whether it is active or not what are the results for this particular ad the result is page likes so what is the number of page likes you've received the the reach that the ad has and the cost per like and the total amount spent Facebook also gives you a relevancy score out of 10 as to how relevant your ad is and the more relevant ads you make the the cheaper it will be for you to to run those ads. Uh there are a lot of other things that you can do inside the Facebook ad manager. We are going to create another tutorial for this and I'll come back to you with that tutorial. Go ahead and create a few ads yourself. Try different kinds of audiences, different kinds of campaigns and if you have any doubts, any questions, please feel free to reach out to me and we'll discuss it and we'll learn more together thank you for your time i'll come back soon with another tutorial